innovation, information, ideas. The Institute of Museum and Library Services honors 10 of the nation's extraordinary museums and libraries who are helping citizens build 21st century skills and global awareness. The Institute awards the National Medal for Museum and Library Service to five libraries and five museums for their outstanding contributions to the communities they serve. The Institute of Museum and Library Services is the nation's primary source of federal funding for museums and libraries, small and large, rural and urban. We congratulate the winners of the 2009 National Medal for Museum and Library Service. The Braille Institute Library Services stands as a great equalizer in its Southern California community, serving blind, visually impaired, reading disabled, and physically handicapped patrons. The library runs book clubs for adults and children, records daily readings of national newspapers in English and Spanish, and partners with local healthcare facilities, libraries, and schools, contributing significantly to the independence that its community continually strives for. At the Children's Museum of Pittsburgh, community development is a top priority. From its charm bracelet program that gathers local institutions to collaborate on community building initiatives, to its new green building, providing a home for six child-oriented nonprofit organizations working together under the museum's roof, the Children's Museum of Pittsburgh has established itself as a community leader in its Northside neighborhood and beyond. The Cincinnati Museum Center in the historic Union Terminal is an educational and cultural complex that has successfully merged five cultural institutions under the historic Union Terminal's Great Half Dome. The center offers visitors a window into the history of the city, state, and nation with cultural programs, amazing artifacts, and exciting events. The Cincinnati Museum Center is the hub of cultural education in Greater Cincinnati. Illinois' Gail Borden Public Library is so much more than a place to borrow books. With interactive exhibits such as Space, Dare to Dream, and Giants, African Dinosaurs, cultural awareness programs like the Tapestry of Freedom, and initiatives to get every local child a library card, the Gail Borden Public Library, a center for literacy, learning, and exploration. For more than a century, the Indianapolis Museum of Art has operated under the principle that art should be cultivated, studied, and available to all. The museum invests in youth through its Viewfinders Art Education Program for Children and its Museum Apprentice Program for Teens. Beyond its walls, the museum's Art Babble website connects art to art enthusiasts, reinforcing the museum's community roots and international reach. In Portland, the Multnomah County Library's enriching programs demonstrate its commitment to literacy and lifelong learning for children, adults, and the diverse community it serves. Through ESL courses, it's welcome to the library multilingual DVD series, raising a reader program for young readers, and its lifelong access initiative for older Oregonians, the library ensures that none of its patrons are left behind. Over its 50-year history, the Museum of Science and Industry has grown from a small two-room museum into a 74-acre facility and the most visited museum in Florida. Whether the museum is teaching and amazing its visitors or working with youth from the surrounding community through initiatives like the National Hispanic Scientist Program, the Museum of Science and Industry is cultivating the new generation of science and technology leaders. Chicago's Pritzker Military Library is filled with books, artifacts, and photographs that tell the story of the citizen soldier in America. As the only U.S. military library that is free, open to the public, and not located on a military base, 
these stories of sacrifice and service reach beyond the library's walls with weekly television broadcasts, webcasts, and podcasts of the library's programs. Live events with military authors, scholars, and Medal of Honor winners have become a unique resource for studying the contributions of the citizen soldier throughout American history. Ohio's Stark County District Library believes in inspiring ideas, enriching lives, and creating community. Through its programs for children and mothers that emphasize literacy and creativity, local bookmobiles for adults and kids, and assistance for job seekers, the library continues to remain a constant in the lives of its patrons, as it has for 125 years. The Tennessee Aquarium is teaching and leading the next generation of environmental pioneers through its dedication to protecting and restoring wildlife. The aquarium's educational exhibits and programs contribute to the ecological and economical well-being of the surrounding Chattanooga community. The Institute of Museum and Library Services is proud to honor the exemplary winners of the 2009 National Medal for Museum and Library Service. This presentation was created for the Institute of Museum and Library Services by the History Channel.